the ones that I'm gonna get right now, those are, um, shit, I've been talking for four minutes. My freaking camera just scared the mess out of me. Let me move this. <laughs> so we're talking about this. I'm having the most unhealthiest snack right now. Why? Just because I opened the cupboard and saw it there and I'm like, oh, I guess I'll just have some Oreos because I ate dinner from earlier today from around 3 o'clock. Now it's 7, 17. I'm just like, I'm not going to go eat again, at least not like that. So let me just snack for a little bit and then before you know it, it's going to be time to go to bed. So that's why I'm having the Oreos right now. And I'm just catching up on some YouTube videos while I wait for Dwayne to come and to bring my packages up. I've slicked my hair back in this, um, you know, kind of, it's not really low. It's like a mid bun. Um, and I'm really just chilling. This is how I'm going to wear it for the rest of this week. I feel like it's kind of so weird to say for the rest of this week because today is Thursday. And, you know, obviously tomorrow is going to be Friday. But tomorrow is going to be the second day, the third day I'm working for this week. Because my schedule right now is Sunday, Monday. Friday, Saturday. So um, I'm going in tomorrow and Saturday and I'm kind of bummed out because the schedule is supposed to change according to my supervisor and um, I'm everybody's waiting to hear what the new schedule is going to look like and I feel like I'm going to kind of go preparing myself to work Sunday so that even if it changes and I don't work Sunday, at least I was prepared. But if it doesn't change and I do work Sunday, then I was still prepared to work Sunday. But um, I feel like it's kind of annoying too because it's just like everybody else has a schedule where they're able to plan their lives around their jobs and we can't really do that just because, you know, he has decided that he's going to change the schedule weekly or ever so often. I'm not really sure. If he sets the schedule for like the next month, that would be fine too because, you know... It's a whole month out and you get to plan shit ahead of time or whatever, which which is kind of fine to excuse me. So, um, I'm, everybody's kind of on edge waiting to see what the new schedule is going to look like. I'm more so annoyed because I just feel like I like, um, I like a routine when it comes to some stuff. Some things, get, it gets old when you have like a routine, but things like work, I want to have a routine. I want to know that I'm going to wake up this day that day and that day and go to work for the next rest of my life or whatever like everybody else in america and i feel like you don't really get that with this one so that's kind of annoying but um for the most part i'm just here chilling like i said waiting for doing to run up i actually texted him earlier too so i'm like where are you because i'm waiting to get these goddamn packages and two it's um that was not him who replied. I'm waiting to get the packages, and it's freaking raining, which means I'm, I am need him to come to see if... Um, I guess what you think about it, I should just went to the back initially. Or maybe I should just throw my robe on and go downstairs to see if the stuff are inside, especially since it's raining. I'm going to do that. I'm really going to do that, because now he's just annoying me. I'm kind of annoyed right now because just now I looked through the kitchen window which shows you like the back of the yard and I did not see my packages out there. Fine. I went downstairs and I looked in like the entryway area where you know they bring the packages inside or whatever and I still don't see the packages. Maybe I should have went outside. I feel like I'm so annoyed at this point. <laughs> Maybe I should have went outside and, like, looked on the ledge or whatever. But I just want my package. <laughs> I feel like I'm being such a rat right now. But the packages are not outside and it's raining. So I'm assuming, you know, somebody took them up. But they're not inside downstairs either. So where are they? Oh, I was so excited to wear my Toms tomorrow too. But I think tomorrow it's going to be raining. I absolutely love Tom's. I had one before. I don't know what happened to it. But I have a Skechers that is um like the Tom's that I wear from time to time right now. Oh, it's not going to rain tomorrow. 
so I could probably still wear it tomorrow but tomorrow's is gonna be a little bit wet because it rained today so there's that anyways I um I bought the Toms and I bought those no-show socks I think I had mentioned them at one point before and the crazy thing is the socks were just ten dollars for how many pairs one two three four for six pairs I think they're so cute too I might buy another six pairs, but with these six, I already had like four or so, which means I'm going to have enough for like a week so I can wash within a week or whatever. So maybe I don't need to buy another four. And then too, I've been trying to be so practical, you know, I don't buy <clears throat> more stuff than I need. And if it's something I can do without, then I don't buy it either. And I feel like I've always done pretty good where that's concerned in terms of like not buying something if I don't need it but um yeah anyways I have some stuff in my car too that and those are actually stuff that we need right now and I'm I'm buying them on Amazon but it's tell me about Prime Pantry um and I don't know what I'm I'm doing with this Prime Pantry but I need to see if Dwayne brings the water tonight. I actually need to text him and ask him if he bought it. Because if he didn't buy it, then I'm going to buy some water on Amazon for like, it's $2 for a case of 12. Is it 12? That's probably a lot. Normally it's 24. Okay, that's not bad. And then I'm getting some cereal and like some snacks and stuff. Um, and like some paper towel that I'd buy for pretty much the same price. At the Dollar Tree. 150 plates for $10? Okay, that's probably, yeah, that's probably not too bad. Yes, yeah, so I have these stuff in my cart that I need to buy. Apparently they're on like Prime Pantry. I also need to buy some, some AA batteries because this remote works with the AA batteries. And today I really thought I had AA, but I remember when I went and checked their AAA, and I remember that the other day when I was buying them, I thought I was buying double A, but it's not until they got here that I realized that they're triple A and I was like, oh, so annoyed. So what I'm getting downstairs is the Excedrin and the no-show socks. And then, because even today I felt like a slight headache and I took two of the Excedrin really quickly. The ones that I'm going to get right now those are, um, should I've been talking for four minutes. The ones that I'm going to get right now, those are the gel ones. So, you know, that dissolves into your body quickly. I'm not a doctor. I'm just assuming, you know, because it's gel, it's probably going to dissolve into your body quicker. So I got those gel ones, assuming that they work a little bit quicker and stuff, which I'm pretty excited about, which means that now when I have a headache, like shit is going to work real quick. So there is that, but for the most part, I'm waiting to get this stuff and it don't look like I'm going to get them now. So I need to stop doing and see what time he's going to come home just so I can get the packages and shit. But um, I'm just chilling and watching some YouTube videos like I had said before and I thought the package was down there, but it's not. So guys, finally got the no-show socks, which I think are so cute. Um, Six pairs. But I did not get the package from Tom's and I got the... What's the other thing? No, I got the Excedrin, but right now I'm about to go to bed because I'm kind of upset that I didn't see the package from, um, from Tom's because where the crap is it? What is this? But, um, I absolutely love the socks and I'm still waiting for Dwayne to come home, so... Maybe he could, um, maybe he could bring them for me, or, that's full, or at least see if, you know, he sees them down there, but I'm about to head to bed. If I find it tomorrow, then I'll insert the clip inside here or whatever, but if I don't, <laughs> but mother, I'm going to tie my hair up so that tomorrow I don't have to do that much combing. Um, all I'd have to do is pretty much
Yeah, she's going to bed. Oh, my Excedrin. So, I have to make sure that I have some of these in my bag. I have this in my bag with, like, you know, pads, tampons, stuff like that. Penny liners. Just the things you would need if you got messed up on the streets. An extra penny. And instead of this, I have, like, some Tylenol and... You know, other pills, Moltrin, Advil, or whatever. So, what I'm going to do is mix them all because I know what they are. And then I have the rest of my Excedrin and whatever else I have going on here. So, I'm about to go to bed. Right? About to end this vlog. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in my next one.